Hi, my name is Jodie Johnson and welcome to Tonic Studios. I'm with... Alison. <laughs> it's my best bud, yeah? We are going to introduce you to our brand new launch of The Milk Churn. Look at them. They the are stunning. Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. I think the girls have gone over the top with these. The pumpkins. I'm sold. Yeah, I'm going to have to show you, and I let's Go show on. you what we got. I'm going to move a couple of these a minute, and we'll show you what we got. So this is how. There we are. We'll go over there. This is your die set as it comes to you in its little folder, and its magnetic sheet, and all your dies. You'll also get a set of stamps. So we've got forty-three. Three. I was going to say two. But I have diddled you. <laughs> 43 lots of dies and also 11 stamps. So I'll show you the stamps now. But look what you've got in there. It is rammed full. Do you think they'd notice if I just took that one? <laughs> <laughs> I love them. I, honestly, there's something. They are amazing. And the, they? they are absolutely beautiful. Love stamps as well. Let's have a look at the stamps, Al. So bring bring those. I bring stamps the boards in. in so you can have a little look. Just look at it. Look at the stamps. I've got a cow. He's lovely. I know. He's gorgeous. I love him. I love him to pe. I I love the fact that it's a little bit. He's a little bit distressed. Yeah, isn't he? he is. He, he's got character. I love him. But that could be his markings. I think that's where they are. It's. Gorgeous. So if you're stamping him and thinking, my cow's not perfect, <laughs> that's the way he's designed. <laughs> We're not selling perfect cows today. We're selling oh. distressed cows. <laughs> that could be taken in so many different ways. Up. Really, really good. See, <laughs> as it is. <laughs> <laughs> I think you better move on before Georgie has a moment. <laughs> I love in the lavender in here, maybe the sage, all these little, I don't know, could it be a little, um, little fox glove? Absolutely. The beautiful. But you've got all the individual leaves up here so you can start to build your, your, your displays as well. But most importantly, you've got the milk churn. I love these though. Yeah. Could be North Pole. It could be anything on there. Absolutely anything. Let's move on and show you what the main the main guy is in this set. It's our milk churn. So a milk, we've, the, 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 the teeth are not right again, are they? Pardon we've got me. the milk churn. We've got a backing card for the milk churn. We've also got another die that cuts an aperture for you to make a shaker. And then they will all layer up together. Will, but the little blisters are actually shaped oh, in there. See them. If I bring this card in, this little layer here is indented into the shaker. I think it's ingenious. I think it just brings that extra bit of oomph to the it actual does. front. It's gorgeous. But then you've got your pump pumpkins. But this die could go on the inside as well, yeah. I mind. Yeah. It could go beautiful. on the inside of the shaker. Love the pumpkins. There's something special about a pumpkin. I'm sorry. And then there's some I love these. I love but how I they're pointing away as well. It's nice to have that differential between. It is. It is. When you're doing the bouquet then. Mm -hmm. You could just bring in different different aspects, can't you? Can. you? Love how I could build those up really, really pretty. And I have to say <laughs> I love that. I love that gift idea. So this you can is pinch that one. Uh, this is one of owls. And look, she's actually put real seeds inside there. Yeah, so it's not only a card, it's actually a gift as well. I love, love that idea. That would be nice for teachers. It would. So if teachers made it and gave each of the children one before the six weeks holidays, for yeah. instance, yeah. and then the kids could see their seeds grow during the school yeah, holidays. Yeah, definitely. Be really, really nice. Something really different. Love it. What else have we got? If you want to find out how to make this, there is a make, a video going out of how to make it. It's available now. It's available, but it also shows how you can make a shaker without the shaker parts. And that could go on a card then. 
I, I, I think these the are the lovely. I love, amazing. I love how the girls have built up a composition, so it really sorts to bring your eye into the front. That's so your garden, isn't it? It is, absolutely, with all the little flowers down the side, the pumpkins at the, at the front. Really, really pretty. Absolutely stunning, Ruth. But yeah, all the pumpkins together just needs a scarecrow. I love it. That's how Christine's made that one. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. But I've got my cow. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I've got, my, I've got my moo cow in the background. I love that cow. There's just something. I love the colours in this card as well, mind. They are beautiful colours. I think it's our grey and the teals. I think I might be having, having a word with upstairs that I need a bigger cow. We'll have to think of a dice set that can put a cow in. Give us some, some. Put it in the comments. <laughs> what can we put a cow in? Yeah, I think, I think that's nice. I like but we've that. gone very spring-like. Look at these. They are just so pretty. The colours. A completely different feel. Absolutely. Absolutely. I love how, how soft they feel. Mm. They feel really, really soft. Stunning. And little pink sequins yeah. in there. So autumn again with all those gorgeous ones in, in there. Absolutely beautiful they are. Really pretty. I love them. And I love the grasses. I think the grasses add a lot. But let's face it, all these individual little dyes, take the milk churn out of this situation in a minute. Everything else you're going mm. to be using behind other things as well, either behind I think so. di different toppers and everything else. Really, It's a really nice bulk. It you, is. You know what? You know when you're making it a card is. and you've got that space and you don't know what to stick there. This is the sort of stuff that you. Yeah, I used to think. You know when you put a bow on a card, yeah. sometimes it doesn't look finished. Do you yeah. put a little bit of greenery around that bow. Absolutely. Tuck it in, and it looks as though you've done so much more than yeah. just a few little bits. Absolutely. And I mean, they they can just be your scraps of cards, yeah, can't they? Can. The bits that you're going to put in the bin. Yeah. Look at this one. Craft metal. Anybody for craft craft metal? Yeah, really, really nice with that craft metal there. But distress it as well. If you've got your craft, yeah. craft metal, you could actually be taking your inks and dribbling your inks down the front. So it could be more verdigris yeah. in, in there, really pretty. <gasps> yes. Look at the depth on this. Claire made this. Look, look at the amount of pads she's got in there. I'll show you from the top as well. She's just created so much depth from these flowers. What a gorgeous little vase, though. They're beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. What is? So, have we shown those? No. What have we shown? Don't forget to cut off. You can cut off your vase, uh, your milk churn as well, to make a vase. Hang on, I'm trying to find oh, the. There you go. Yeah. Look at that one. So you sh you're making more of your flowers then than the churn. Absolutely. It's done then. And then we back to the pumpkin patch with Ruth. Oh, can you remember pumpkin? What, what were those garbage patch kids? Yeah, just Ca cabbage, cabbage patch, patch. Cabbage patch kids. Garbage pa they were from the pumpkin patch, weren't they? Oh, blimey, that's just brought back memories. And then you can go clean and simple, very spring-like, but very clean and simple. Look at that stamp. It's gorgeous. As I said. It on this other video, I am going to be cutting those out in craft cards, stamping in white and colouring my birds in red. That's going to be it my is Christmas beautiful. tag. Beautiful. Absolutely I love gorgeous. these. So these are available now. So for the UK people, these are $36.99. For all you people in the US, they are $38.99. So go and grab yourself these amazing stamps because I've got mine. I'm having, <laughs> I'm having these ones, yeah? She's off. Yeah, I've got mine now. So we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.